All right, boys, here today, I kind of wanted to talk about this. So I was uh, I was on Reddit, yes, that nice cesspool of stuff. Um, and I was in the Grand Cross Reddit, I was checking out something. And one post I found that I, that was like literally something I've been saying forever. Um, and I wanted to share with you, it was a little it was a little bit popular um, from the upvotes and people talking about it. So let me just show this to you, right? It, 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 you're gonna you're gonna be intrigued. And I've been saying this a lot. So this was the post, right? It says, uh, fix the damn game, things Netmarble needs to do, okay? Some of these are, are great, but I wanna talk about this one right now first, okay? Release. More than one unit per banner again. Do you know how angry I'm still at this, like, entire thing? I know people say, hey, it's great for free to place, man. We can choose a unit at 600, screw that other unit. We don't have to, like, pick between one or another. You realize that at this rate, we've went, like, so many banners, we were forced to skip just because it's, like, one singular unit. Who has two units? First off, summoning would be a little bit better for a lot of people. Whales wouldn't have to suffer. And in an entire thing, look at this, right? The last time... We had a double unit banner, don't count a collab, I'll slap you, ready? This wasn't, 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 wasn't. What, we're in, we're in March and it wasn't. Look, look, we're in January, freaking January. And it was Scotty and a latte, January. So we went through February, March, April, May, June, July, and now August, we already know it's Zaldris and then probably another single unit banner. So you're gonna go through all of this, all of this time. And again, the, the, the freaking double unit banner was a latte and Scotty. Go before that. Sariel was singular. Meliodas, Liz. What is it? We're in December, November now. Again, you had Ryan Rock, Magilda, and Truth Seeker Merlin. You then had a collab, which was fine. You then had this. So again, this is when we had double units. We, we had double units. And then they randomly, so after, we'll say this is the last banner. If you look at it, Magilda, Truth Seeker, Merlin kind of killed everything, okay? The rest of November went with nothing. December went with nothing. Then you went back into January. At the end of January, you went back into a double banner. Then February was screwed. Elaine was solo. Bond, all these were solo. A collab, you have a triple, great job. Back to solo. So, one thing that I want to see fixed ASAP, please bring back double unit banners. Like, Zeldris low-key could have just been on... Berserk Esterosa's banner, it would've been fine. Kind of like Chandler on, uh, you know, the old Fez Eldris. That could've worked. That, that, that literally could've worked, but it's fine. I, I literally do not like it, okay? We had one summer unit. We had, in the, this is the first time in Grand Cross, even the first, I think the first summer uh, event was two characters. In 2020, we had Valenti and Easton. That was summer, a double unit. We went all this time now, and this year, we had one summer unit. One, it was Deanne, which we couldn't summon for just because like mainly it was a PvE character and just limited to demons, so you had to skip it for some reasons. Why, why? And again, a solid point that I wanna say, and I really wanna say this, we don't need any more Meliodas till we get like a big, big named one, or like Purgatory Meliodas, Demon, whatever Meliodas, you know what I'm trying to talk about. That's fine. We don't even need any more Deans. Bring back other characters. They exist, literally, Escanor has three units in the game. That's it. Camilla, one unit. She has one unit, and I'm pretty sure everyone has like two to three. Where is Camilla? Where, where like genuinely, it's not even funny. You have like nine DNs this year. Queen DN, Halloween DN, Summer DN. Bro, how many more DNs do we need? I'm sorry, you might love DN, uh, forgive me. I I'm sorry, but you know, we need e e Escanor. Fine, we need Escanor. We need Camilla finally getting a new unit maybe sometime. Even I would have been okay with anybody else getting a Christmas unit, okay? We have Summer Merlin, that's fine. You could have did you could have done so many things for Christmas. Um, so this year, let's see. Halloween, bring back that Halloween escort and leave from like a millennia ago. Great stuff could happen. They could happen. On a second thing, they also listed uh what is it, update old unit stats slash skills. I don't know why they haven't done that. They did that like brother bond and then just gave up. Like it was like, hey. There you go, and screw the rest of them. So that's that. Make us be able to buy the cosmetics without being forced to own the unit. Do you know that they're ruining Hawk Pass? Like, the Hawk Pass is so stupid because I skipped. Okay, hear me out. I skipped the end. Still regretting it. Thank you for everyone laughing at me. Now, what happens is, if I if, if they don't put the end back between now and a month, that DN costume will leave. So when it's gone, I can't do anything. I can't get that back for like, what, a millennia until they decide to rerun Hawks, uh, Hawk Pass skins, which I don't think they're gonna do. So I'll just have to lose the costume. So that's an example. With a new mono one that's really cool, that Penguin one, I'll have to lose that too. Like recently I got Scotty, accidentally. So I now have Scotty, okay? Like that's fine. I was able to buy this before it went, beautiful. 
but I'm going to lose out on Mono, I'm going to lose out on Tarmiel if I don't get that, and I'm going to lose out on Deanne. So, it's stupid. It's stupid, that's all it is. And then return this uh, <laughs> this guy to the game, Red Tarmiel, most likely will return with the uh, Zeldris' banner. Um, if you look at what Estorosa's banner is, it's the other Archangels, and I'm telling you now, Zeldris' banner will be the other Archangel. So the green Tarmiel, and then the red Tarmiel, in, you know, the opposite of what the Estoros banner is. That's what's gonna happen, so just keep that in mind. But, yeah, they could have made Estoros' banner better by adding on Tarmiel, but instead, they didn't. So, hey, you, you take what you want with that. Next thing that I want to talk about, release the damn mode. Like, we've been waiting for this thing forever. It would have been such a nice drop to release it with this Annie because people were, like, waiting for a mode. And this entire festival, whatever, it was garbage. This 2.5 Global Annie. Um, I get it that some of the rewards are great. Some of the rewards are great. That, that, that's true. But there's no content. There's no nothing to look forward to. Um, like, beforehand, when the summer update was there, I was logging in for actual stuff. I don't know why, I'm not logging in as much. Um, I've been just messing around using Esterosa and that's about it. I had more fun using Esterosa than doing any of the events. We have one event, which is like the crab, which was finished in the first, in the first day for um, the, the cooperation thing. Great, you added that, nice. But there was no new content, no anything added. I was expecting at least a freaking boss, but no. So please release this. Okay, we need, we need content. And where the fudge is this guy? They said in August, we're, we're in August right now. But um, yeah, I'm still waiting for this. Hopefully it drops with Zeldris. If not, end of the month with uh, with Ragnarok. So both these things, I'm actually dying to see what they do with. This mode has so much potential. And just remember, their entire hype up of the uh, Ancient War. I really hope this this doesn't end up like Ancient War. If this ends up like Ancient War, that's gonna be so bad, okay? I get it, people like Ancient War. Okay, have fun. Go off into your little corner. That thing was just a stamina. It was like you just burned stamina for no reason. Genuinely, right? You just get enough to get those gems and you just quit. Just give up. The rewards weren't worth the time. It was a bad event, okay? Fun for like two minutes. Other than that, yikes, dude. But uh, yeah, we need these. Please release content. This update was this update was yikes. And again, we complain about this every time, so this doesn't actually mean anything to anyone or to Netmarvel. But why do you keep making the banners worse? Like, I swear they said it in, a, in like a dev notes. Oh, we'll make the drop pool way better so that you guys don't have to suffer. This drop pool was bad. Even for players that are starting off the game. Like, I don't know, dude. This was, this was bad. Genuinely, like, you could have just, just swapped out him with, you know, Red Tarmiel, made it a must summon. And then Green Sariel for people that don't have Green Sariel. Like, you could you have done stuff. You really could have. Or, or hear me out. Release a second unit, right? Like we had Zeldris and Estros on here. Wow, who would have thought? But yeah, that Labyrinth mode literally needs to come out soon. I have been dying for that thing, and I'm still gonna stand here hoping that it's gonna be good. I have, I have faith that this Labyrinth mode won't suck. If it sucks, hey, I have nothing else, man. I'm really on copium for it. So, with that being said, that's my uh, quick vent. Thank you for listening. Enjoy the rest of your day. Release two unit banners again. That's the literal one thing I want. Okay, I just. I know people are gonna say, hey, free to plays are suffering, but bro, I'm gonna be honest with you. We need two unit matters back. You need you need two units, right? One might suck miserably, but you like the other one. So while you while you're diving in for that one unit, you get a second one. You know what I mean? I don't know. 